Just wanted to give you a brief update on some of the activities we have at the USDA lab in East Grand Forks. Uh, first of all, the storage campaign from the 2020 crop. Uh, those results will be published in the uh, September issue of the Valley Potato Grower. Uh, this year we have about 40 uh, russet processing clones and 50 chip processing clones grown up here in the Laramore Research Pivot. Uh, representing 11 uh, public breeding programs. So we'll be evaluating those throughout storage um, again through July of 2022. A uh, couple things, obviously we're gearing up for the storage and harvest campaign. So we are busy doing pre-harvest sampling. Uh, we're really gearing up doing some of the sugars and fry tests for some of the, the processors. Those that haven't utilized our lab, uh, come come talk to me. We can get some scheduling uh, completed if you have some pre-harvest sugars you want to do uh, want us to do for you. Uh, one thing that I always fail to acknowledge is some of my staff. We have a couple of my staff here. So just Tyler Teske and and Stacy Lean, if you can raise your hands. Um, one of them was hired during COVID, so she hasn't. This is her first opportunity in person. Um, I'm grateful for their contributions and getting the lab running smooth. Uh, as far as some other studies that we go have going on in Laramore, we are doing a replicated yield trial with a couple of processing varieties from Europe. And this is with Charlie Higgins of Potatoes USA. Uh, th that data will be released here um, as it's compiled. Um, and then just uh, following up on some other, other research, we are working with Andy and Susie and evaluating some bruising. Uh, our pressure studies are, are ongoing on some of the new varieties. We also have some several variety specific management trials that are ongoing with NDSU and several of the processors. So um, it's busy. Um, and then the other, other ARS colleague that couldn't be here today, uh, Dr. Munever Dogramasi, she's out of the country. I would like to introduce her postdoc, uh, Dr. Sagar uh, Datir, there he is down in front. He will be, he's stationed in Fargo, and again, their lab, they're looking at uh, the physiological, some, several physiological studies. One, I think that Sagar is working on is dormancy, but she's working closely with Susie on, on some skin set issues as well. So I just wanted to take the time to acknowledge. I know she we never regrets that her schedule, she wasn't able to see you guys in person. Um, it's great to have her working in the ARS or the potato team as well.